Hey guys, what's up? I'm going to be going over to Duntoker today. I'm going to be doing a video there. Oh, there's actually a missing person here. Look, Angela Keenan. If any of you guys see this woman, make sure to phone police and... I don't know. But that's nothing to do with the video. Anyway, we're going to Duntoker today. So, as we get into Duntoker... This is Duntoker. There's a bloody Union Bears thing. Boo! We hate Union Bears. There's some pubs, like there's the Tenants Pub right there. I think this building is actually really old. The building that we're coming up to is even older. So this building right here is a really old building. I've been told, oh this one I think. I've been told this has been here since 18 something, although I'm not quite sure on that. But um, yeah, there's also these buildings as well. I think that these are flats. Oh, they've got, looks like, a garage there, and garage, garage, whatever you want. We've got an SO garage here, and a Mesa Local. You know, I didn't know before that it was actually Mesa Local. You've got Chinese Spring Garden. It sounds quite cool. I like the green. That green is amazing. You can see the SO on the sign. We're going to keep walking along. I know there's, like, some pubs. Oh, there's actually a wee stream down here. I never actually come here, so I don't know so much about it, but yeah, we'll have a look. You've got a lot of like industrial tyre repair shops along here actually, um, that repair your cars, your tyres, yeah. I mean these houses are quite nice actually, these ones up here, and you can actually go up there, there's some stairs up there, but these actually look quite good actually. Maybe Duntoker isn't as bad as I thought. Well, there might be good parts, there might be bad parts. I'm gonna have a look. This is called Glen Head Tavern. Definitely a pub. I passed this in the car. Look, oh yeah, it is. Wine and Spirits. And there's another one right next to it. Oh no, that's a loud. There's actually a toilet here. I think that's a toilet. We're getting into the main kind of part. I guess that's a wee car park there. It's actually a beauty, the beach's hair salon there. Done Toker Pharmacy. Done Pharmacy here. And, oh, they've also got the park over there as well. Oh, now we're getting into the estates. Now we're getting into the estates. Oh, it's down there, I want to check. The Dunty Glennon. Oh, yeah, this is the Dunty. And I forgot to tell you guys. This is where the Dunty Boys stay. Dunty Boys. Ah, uh, yeah, it's definitely a, a pub. And a post office, actually. They might sell good IV tree bars in there. Yeah, that's definitely the way into the pub. Um, there's a spa. Spars are, are overpriced, in my opinion. Gingerbread dreams. The ironing station. Although a lot of these look kind of ripped down or run down, but we're going to go over there. They look even more run down. The Village Tavern, Duntoker. Let's go have a look. So this is a, a big pub over here. Well, maybe not that big. The Village Tavern. 1556. That's quite old, actually. Actually, that's more than quite old. That's really old. But we're actually going to cross the road here. Envy. Okay, now we're entering a residence only. Well, I think that only means vehicle, so I think I'll be okay. But I think we're entering into the scheme park, so I me. I defo. Oh, shite. <laughs> I was not expecting that, man. That, I would hate to live in that, I'm sorry. But not my cup of tea. Now, we're walking down this street. I don't know, but this gives me strange Faithly by vibes. By the way, we'll be doing Faithly in a video soon, don't worry. Um, these kind of flats look a wee bit like that. Kind of. Or the houses over there. This is a big flat though. It's very brown. This reminds me of Faithly a lot. This one. Although they're very close to each other, so I can see why that would probably be the case. But I, you would enter in this way, you'd probably have to 
<laughs> Does this not have a buzzer? Let's have a look. Oh, you can just enter. Shall we go up to the top? Well, I was certainly not expecting this. So this is the highest it goes, actually. And there's lots of other flats around here in the houses. And there's some more brown buildings over there. It can't be too loud because there's residents here. You should get out before I get bottled or something. Now, these flats look a lot more modern than the other ones. And probably more high-end. No, I mean, we're going to walk back up this way. We're going to go back to the town centre. I might have missed some things about it. I walked down another street. You know where that brown building was? I started to walk down here. Now, these houses here aren't actually too bad. They actually look quite luxury, these. Well, not very luxury, but sort of. I thought Duntoker was really small, but actually it's really big. Right, well, not really big, but... Oh, there's a lane down there. Shall we go down? There's some water, the lovely stream down there. That's actually quite nice to sit and watch it if you're bored. Although you might find some of the dunty boys here. Eat me! Who's it, Gian, bro? And we're to this street that I actually have no idea. <laughs> right, let's go back. There's another wee shop here. Lifestyle Express. In a wee part like this. Oh, there comes more houses. This reminds me of Faithfully again. These. And there's the yellow sandstone ones that remind me of Clyde Bank. Or any other place in Glasgow. But, and then you got the high-end ones over there. Yeah. Now, this street reminds me of Clyde Bank. Because there's lots of houses like this in Clyde Bank. I don't know, it gives me Clyde Bank vibes. Oh yeah, there's actually barbers here. And uh, coffee, aroma coffee. If you want to have a coffee with somebody, say you want like a bird or something, to go out with a coffee, come to Duntoker, you can get a coffee. Most luxury place in the whole world. <laughs> now we're coming up to this street, they have more of these billards here. Billards? Is that what the word is? Oh, you've got a church there. It looks like a church. Some more. These are actually okay apartments. I mean, I, I would live in them. Oh, look. There's the Virgin Mary up there. And it, got, it looks really nice. Actually, you could have a lovely picnic there. And then there's some more Clyde Bank looking houses up there. Looks like somebody's had a bit too much fun with their bird. <laughs> Duntoker Library. I actually have a library here. Never been in it. Although it looks like he's getting work done on it. Or no, maybe he's just sweeping, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, so this must be the back of the church, yeah. Must be the back of the church. Oh, there's a Scotland flag up there. Scotland, yeah. Yeah, you got a... And that looks like a shite hole. How could you put that next to a Scotland flag? Shame on us, man! <laughs> Do not enter! Do not, you're not allowed to enter a library. This is the back of the library. You're not allowed to enter the library. Wow. Maybe it's a murderous library. Maybe there's like junkies in there. Eat me with bottles. And if you go in, you'll get shanked. <laughs> so we're going to have a look in the village green. Someone's graffitied on that. What bastards, this better be a nice place. So this is the village green then. I was expecting more, much more like a garden of Eden. Like beautiful birds, beautiful green grass. Yet yeah, you get bins with shite all over them. And graffiti, S-Y-M. I do not know what that means. Well, now I can understand why there's graffiti on the sign. That plant looks so depressing. Fish and chips! You gotta love some fish and chips. Along with a Tango Ice Blast and a pizzeria right next to it in the exact same building. Wow, that is awesome. <laughs> Roman Road. There's a, the name in Bear's Den, Roman Road, as well. I'll tell you why, right? There's a lovely church, I've been up here. This is where the Antonine Wall was built. 
The Antonine Wall the Romans built went along here. From Bear's Den, Kirk and Tillich, Mogai, I think. Bowness, it went all the way to Bowness. And this is a Catholic church over here, actually. We're going to take a look at it. Salvation, praise, and the gates. Wait, when was this? 1830, since 1830. Sorry, my finger got in the camera there. And I'll show you what proves my point, right? Antonine. I oh, sorry, you can't really see that. It says Antonine Sports Centre. A war memorial here. This is probably for, yeah, World War I. 1914 to 1980. Got the remembrance things down here. It's got all the names of the many people who helped us during the war. Respect. I respect that. See, look, Antonine Wall and Roman Fort. Antonine Wall, Dantoka Fort, Play Park. They actually have a play park up there. It's actually all Roman themed. It's actually quite cool. But I'm just going to go back this way. There's a good and cheap. Um, Chinese there actually, it's got pans on it, if you ever want. Delicious Chinese and European hot meals to carry out. Pretty good. So, actually we're going to go back. I'm going to show you a way that you can get to Faithly quickly. Oh Christ, I got mud on my shoe man. Well, I, oh fuck this, you know, I don't really want to go through this way but, nah, let's go back. <laughs> There's a lot of stickers on that sign. See, look, the boys. Come on, all you boys in green. They've got a Rangers. Fuck the Rangers. I don't know what that green one is there. That's Paisley, that red one. And now we're back to Hardgate. I'm going to do Hardgate in another video, guys. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. And sub to my YouTube, put the bell on, so then you never miss a video I upload. Because I like doing these, and a lot of you guys enjoy them. So... Thanks guys for watching and keep being swagger bro. Nah, that was, that was so ruined. <laughs> keep being awesome.